In this Studio One quick tip, I'll show you how you can combine multiple audio events into one event. There are two different ways of combining events and both have their benefits. The first option is to merge the events. First make sure you have the arrow tool selected here in the toolbar. Then select all events that you like to merge, either by drawing a selection with your mouse or just select one event and then press shift and select the other events. And then you only need to hit G on your computer keyboard and this will combine the events into a new container called audio part. That you can still move on the timeline, but it's now a container of events. The good thing about merging is that it's non-destructive. That means that you can double click the container to open the editor and here you see all the original events. So you can still edit the gain of the events or the fades or you can right click to change the settings of the events. You can't do this in the arrangement view because it's not an audio event anymore, it's now an audio part. And that's also why it now has this chain icon. And the second benefit of merging is that you can easily bring back the original events if you need them. Just select the audio part, go into the audio menu and choose Dissolve Audio Part. And that's going to reveal your separate events back in the arrangement. The second option is to bounce the events. Again, select all events you want to combine and then hit Ctrl B or Command B on Mac. This creates a new audio file on your computer and renders all the audio events into a new event that you can edit like any other events in the arrangement window. But once you have bounced events into a new audio event, you can't go back later to edit your cuts or fades anymore. You're gonna lose your original events. So unless you really need an actual audio event in the arrangement, that could be because you want to apply event effects for example, then I really recommend to simply merge the events because that way you don't lose your original events and you can always go back later. Please like and subscribe if you found this quick tip helpful. Thanks for watching.